What's up guys, Charlie NASCAR here, coming at you with the pre-race Daytona video. Unfortunately, I won't be able to go to the race due to financial reasons, but that's alright. I'm going to watch the race, I'm going to be enjoying myself, 420 style for the race, so we're going to be alright, alright? I'm excited about this race for a couple reasons. Number one, plate racing. It's my favorite, it's my buddy Shiny Knife's favorite. Check out his channel, I know a lot of you do. He's a good dude, man. Got a lot of interesting videos. He does a lot of videos on gear and everything. A lot of cool stuff, man. He's also, if you like pro, pro football, you know, I don't personally, but if you do, he's got a really cool pick channel. I've actually entered in his pick contest, not knowing a damn thing, and I got a couple knives to show for it, so check him on out. You know, got a couple other channel shout-outs, man, for NASCAR-related, like Dorsef, JB Racing News, and, um... Righteous Redneck, check them fellas out too. Because they're all going to be watching the race. They're all going to be doing contests just like I am. So go ahead and win yourself some shit. But anyway guys, enough of all that. I'm excited. I am hyped up. I, I, I need this race. I need it. I think it's going to be a good one. I was looking back through the archives of my previous videos. And I remember my first video I ever did... My second video, actually, my first one was a pre-race video for Daytona by member. My first post-race video was for Denny Hamlin winning the Daytona 500. We all remember that race. He just edged out Martin Truex. Fuck Toyota, fuck Toyota. All right. But I'm hoping history repeats itself. I'll give it away in the pick four. But I think I know who the winner is going to be. Oh, yeah. It's going to be a Ford. going to be a lot of Fords in there. But anyway, guys, it's a two and a half mile track, man. There's going to be some beating and banging. I have a good feeling. I don't know. I just, I just have a really good feeling about this race. I don't know why, but I am extra hyped up. I mean, I'm extra hyped up about this. Also, might be because I'm off for the next like, well, I'm off for four days for the fourth, the Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. So I got a lot more energy that I'm not working. So I'm just like, woo. But anyway, guys, this race, uh, if you miss this race, guys, I feel bad for you. You better DVR it. You better get yourself in front of a TV. Cancel all plans. Put everything on hold for this race. Because this thing is going to be a great freaking race. Ah, sweet tea. Gotta love it. But anyway, guys, I'm going to stop bantering on because I know why y'all really watch this. You want get to get in on this pick four contest. Hopefully we can have a winner. I know my buddy JB had a winner a couple weeks back. For his, he does his a little bit differently. That's all right. They're all good people. Mine is you got to have it all in order. The top four in order. That's where it gets complicated, especially for plate racing. Guys, don't overthink it. Just go with your gut. But anyway, the way you win in my contest is simple. Or kind of simple, maybe. Depends. Get your comments in before the green flag drops down here in the comment section on this video. Or you can hit me up on Twitter. Either way, it's all good with me. So anyway, let me go ahead and give you my top four picks. And fourth, I'm going to go Daniel Hemrick. Yes, I know I said don't overthink it, but yeah, I got to throw in one in there. Okay, and third, yeah, I know he's a Chevy also. But it's all right. The rest are going to be Ford, so it's all just comma britches. Third, I'm going Paul Menard. Second, oh, oh, no, wait a minute. I got, I got, I'm going to have two Chevys in there. I'm going to have two. Oh, I'm going to have two. Okay, guys, I lied to you. It's going to be like two Chevys and two Fords in this. All right, I'm going William Byron in second because he's going to go ahead and be leading, and then. Someone's going to take him out ahead from somebody he's had a previous dust up with. And if history repeats itself, when Denny Hamlin wins the 500, guess who wins the Coke or Pepsi or whatever soda is sponsoring the Coke, I think. Brad Keselowski. He will be winning. It'd be big old bad Brad. Restrictor plate Brad. Old yeah, we'll go with that. I'm, I'm, I can't think of any more nicknames. Brad's awesome. All right, one of my favorites. He's not Ryan Blaney favorite, but 
Blaney, Blaney ain't ready to win this race, but he'll 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 get some wins this year. Him and Menards and all of them, like I don't. But that's who I'm going with, guys. Love to hear who your picks are. And guys, I want you all to be good to each other. Remember how blessed we are. Thank you for our men and women who served in our armed forces. You know, July 4th, you know, it's a day about freedom. All right? And our forefathers. You know. So let's all take the time and just be thankful, man. Don't complain. Don't bitch. Don't say not a dang bird thing about bad about anybody. And more importantly, fuck Toyota.